Hello everyone. In this session, we will go over how to deploy a Rag chatbot using Streamlit Cloud. In our last session, we discussed deploying a Rag chatbot on a local machine using Streamlit. You can find the URL to that guide in the top right corner of the screen. To deploy on Streamlit Cloud, you will need a Streamlit account, a GitHub account with a repository containing a requirements.txt file and a Python script, which will serve as the entry point for the deployment. Apart from these files, you will need all the scripts, files or folders that you might have utilized to prepare Streamlit dashboard. I have shared the URL of a sample repository in the description box for this video. Now let's see the step by step process. First, we will see how to create a Streamlit account. For that, go to Streamlit sign up page. The URL is highlighted on the screen. Click continue to sign in. On the next screen, you will see three sign in options. Here, I will demonstrate using continue with Google option. Choose the Google account you would like to use. Complete the account setup by filling in any required details and then click on continue. Now your Streamlit account is ready and you will get the screen as shown. Next, you need to link your GitHub account. To deploy apps from your GitHub repository, you need to link your GitHub account with your Streamlit account. For that, click on workspaces, then connect GitHub account. In the next screen, you will be prompted to enter your GitHub username and password. After logging in, Streamlit will request authorization to access your GitHub account. Click on Authorize Streamlit to complete the link. Please note here that by default Streamlit only has access to public repositories. To grant access to private repositories, go to Settings in Streamlit which is accessible via the username dropdown. Under Linked Accounts, click on Connect here in the Private Access section. Again, you need to authorize Streamlit over here to allow access to your private repositories. Here again, authorize the Streamlit. After this, your GitHub account will be fully linked with Streamlit and you are ready to deploy apps from your GitHub repositories. Next, we will see deploying the chatbot application. Here, let's go through the steps to deploy the Rag chatbot app from GitHub. I will be using a sample repository as shown on the screen for this deployment. First, I will show how to deploy the app using the streamlit.py file. However, because of resource limitation, which I have got due to using large model size, this approach caused an error. To solve this, I deployed the app using a modified file called streamlitcloud.py in which I have used very small size model. So to create Streamlit Cloud app, click on create app. On the next screen, select deploy a public app from GitHub. Since your GitHub account is connected, you will see a list of repositories. In my case, I will be using Streamlit repository. Select the branch that contains all the required files. Then you need to select the main file path as well. Or you need to select the main file as well. You can also provide a custom app URL here if you want a specific name. After that, select on this advanced setting option. Here, if needed, adjust settings such as Python version, environment variables or secrets. Click save if you make any changes. Finally, click on deploy button. The deployment screen will appear showing the progress. To view the deployment logs, click on manage app. As you can see, you will be able to see the logs of deployment process. Please note, in my case, due to the large model size, as I mentioned earlier, the initial deployment failed with a resource constraint error. So I got error as shown on the screen. In case if you want to download the logs, just click on these three dots. In the opened menu, you will get the option to download the log. Now, I resolve the issue by deleting the old app which has been deployed by that streamlit.py file. Then I deployed a new app using this streamlitcloud.py file which you can see on the screen. Once the deployment 
has been successful, you can access the chatbot at the app URL you selected during the setup. In my case, it was App Cloud. You should see a functional chatbot interface on the dashboard with UI elements reflecting those defined in your scripts. This allows users to interact with the chatbot on Streamlit Cloud. That's it for the day. Thank you everyone for watching this video.